Today on Wood Turning, we're going to make a floating bowl out of these. Tim's American Beauty was made by Robust Tools, America's premier lathe manufacturer. Robust. Built to turn wood. Enjoyed for a lifetime. Easy Wood Tools, best in class carbide wood turning tools. What the heck is this guy doing? I really don't know myself. <laughs> so I've got the three pieces here and I've used double sided turner's tape. It's really heavy duty stuff so it's hopefully going to hold these together. I drilled a hole on this end and there's a worm screw in here so we're holding this just like a bowl, right? But uh, we're going to hollow it out here in, in just a second <laughs> because hopefully that will really work. But what I want to do off the bat is to thank our sponsors Robust Lays and Easy Wood Tools because without their support we would not be here and it wouldn't be a lot of fun not being here turning for you guys. And speaking of Robust, for the next two weeks, they're offering 10% off and free shipping on their tool rests and turning tools. You have to use code TIM10, that's T-I-M-1-0, and this expires March 13th, and it's for U.S. sales only and only for those products. So to attack this beast, we're going to try to hollow this out with the tailstock in place right now. I want to see how well that tape holds. It should be fine, but might as well be cautious about it. So I'll get my googles on, I've got a bowl gouge, and we're going to turn this on at a very slow speed and bring it up. We're going to have a wobble for sure. So this won't be a fast hollowing. There's the wobble. I can go a little past that I think and see it straightened out right there. So I am at about uh, 340 RPM right now. So we're going to come in and this is just like hollowing a bowl out but I have a tailstock in the way so we'll just have to try a different approach and come in this way and just take light cuts and we're not going to take a lot of wood out at a time. And at this slow speed I just have to let the tool feed itself. But our goal is to hollow out the two top pieces and maybe a little bit of the bottom piece to give us that bowl shape. So, <laughs> note self when turning basswood, wear a face mask. <laughs> um, I'm using the Easy Wood Negative Rake Scraper here to clean the inside as I go down. The cool thing is about this is we don't have to hollow all this wood out right here because it's a core that's going to pop off here in a second. <laughs> and let's see, <laughs> let's see if that happens. <laughs> going to come in with the bowl gouge and try to go through right here and go to the next piece. Hopefully everything will stay on. I should have tape on this side and tape on that side. If I don't, step back. <laughs> there we go, I think we're real close now. There we go. And it went through, hang on a second, it just sounded bad, but no, it went through great. This is holding. It chipped a little bit, you see that? Because this is basswood. Basswood is not the easiest thing to turn. So we're cool now. I'm going to smooth this inside out. We're going to pop that off. So a little bit more work here. Thank you for not falling apart. Okay, this is where this negative rake scraper comes in really handy because it takes very, doesn't take a lot of pressure to cut. So we're going to just come in here and nibble it away. There we go. <laughs> Came off great. Now what we have left is this core here. You can see I turned down a little bit into this, so now I know the direction I'm going, so it all kind of looks the same. Let's see if I got a little chisel here. See how lucky I'm in, in with this. <laughs> yeah, it comes off real easy. Boy, this tape works great. Maybe too great. <laughs> So next week, we're going to be doing an episode on how to remove tape. No, <laughs> There we go. Cool beans. So the next step is we're just going to start hollowing this out and go a little bit into the bottom piece.
Now we've broken through to the next piece and you can see I've really slowed the lathe down. We found out on the first piece, if you keep the RPMs up too much, it can actually flip the ring off. It didn't do it, but I saw some cracks appearing on it. So what we've done is we've taken the lathe really slow now. We're at about, oh, about 100 RPM maybe? And I'm just gonna get a clean intersection here. And then we'll just pop this off, pop the center off, and work on the base. So I'm trimming the bark away just to start seeing what this is going to look like. If we leave all the bark on, it's going to just look like a stack. <laughs> but we might want to leave a little bark on here. And I'm not talking because that stuff tastes terrible. <laughs> so we're going to nibble it away and leave some bark. Let's just take a quick look and see how it's looking. Whew, that's interesting. It's basswood, so it tears out, but that might be kind of cool. So Brian and I were talking, we like the way the bottom looks so much, we want to do it to the top. So I put the double-sided tape on here again. I brought up a round disc, a lot of pressure on here, so this isn't going anywhere. It's not hitting, we're gonna turn it on, stand back in case the bark wants to hit me. Gotta slow that down a bit. <laughs> okay, now we're going good. So now we're just going to do the same thing to the top in the opposite direction. And actually I need to come this way. Here we go. Okay, I've been playing around with this. I've been using some really thick wire that I can bend, but it's still strong. And we drilled three holes in there and we put the wires in so we have legs. <laughs> so I put this up here and get these to fit inside the hole there. And you can play with this however spread apart you want it, how many pieces you want, all that sort of stuff. But <laughs> there we go. That's our floating bowl. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? <laughs> well, until the next time on wood turning, keep turning. Tim's American Beauty was made by Robust Tools, America's premier lathe manufacturer. Robust. Built to turn wood. Enjoyed for a lifetime. Easy Wood Tools, best in class carbide wood turning tools.